Hello and welcome. Our office has moved, and in order to have a meaningful decoration for the office, I volunteer to make up three sort of canvas. And so I have this idea. I've been involved with Tai Chi for nearly fifty years, and twenty-five years. When I reach out to the world, and、uh, we bring Tai Chi for health to the world, it was an incredible journey. It was so exciting. I met so many. Exciting, fascinating people, and learn so much, and、uh, also was able to bring Tai Chi for Health to millions of people. It was、um, a lot, and it's a fun challenge to put it all into three canvas. And hang it on the wall, so that means I really have to learn how to cut down and tell you nearly 50 years or at least 25 years of our story in Tai Chi in maybe five six minutes, and、um, I hope you enjoy them. You don't have to travel to Sydney, Australia, to the office and see what we put there. There's three of these canvases. The first one started from the beginning, and then I wanted to convey a feeling of we develop and grow.、A、Better Health Tai Chi Chuan is founded nearly 40 years ago, and my focus is all about health. Um, we were for a local community base. Started with mostly my patients, then it spread out. All my instructional videos, my workshops, and the Tai Chi for Health programs are created with a lot of help and support from this school, from a small spa. Great frame has risen. There's a Chinese proverb called "Sun Fa Liao Yun." That means little drop of little spark of fire can burn, can spread to the whole plane. And so here is the Better Health Tai Chi Chuan.、Uh, our instructors, the first lot of instructors, we started with myself. Then I trained more instructors, and by 1989. We got together. My father-in-law, Mr. Lam, has amazing Tai Chi background. I didn't know, and found out he learned from at that time, probably still now, the world's most famous Yang style Tai Chi teacher, the great grandson of Yang style creator, and he was Yang Sao Zhong, who escaped from communists to Hong Kong, and my father-in-law was. His first group of students. I was so fortunate too to meet and study very closely for many years. Professor Meng Hui Huang and Professor Kang Kui Xiang. They were two top Chinese、uh, experts in in Tai Chi. In 1993, I won a gold and two silver medals, and the highest aggregate marks in the whole. Uh, competition. I learned a lot from that, and、uh, it also helped me to to kind of a different aspect, and also helped me to get involved later on in competition of the world and learn different aspects, train competitors. About 25 years ago, I got this brainstorm. Bang! Yes, I'm a doctor. I know something about Tai Chi. Well, you know, I'm crazy about Tai Chi. I work really hard, and I, I learn a lot about it. And、uh, I started Tai Chi because of my arthritis, since I was 
And by the time I became a doctor, it was really bad. And Tai Chi really transformed my health. And even now, at 76, I'm not on any medication. I have no joint replacements. With um, 50 years, 63 years of arthritis, uh, that it's got to be the magic of Tai Chi. And I do practice regularly. Something tells me it's me. It's my job to create Tai Chi for arthritis, which I did. And then I, I work with and approach Arthritis Foundation, first in Australia, then throughout the world. I have trained more than a thousand instructors just in Victoria alone. A special arthritis day with 500 people in Melbourne and they have national televisions to interview us. So that is the first phase with the first lot of painting and then if you watch these words empowering the whole idea is empowering people to better health and we'll go to the second painting. Tai Chi Productions even though it's a normal limited company it has never made any money. I have always put money in it to you know producing a video doing all those things are really expensive. All we did is produce Tai Chi teaching materials, books, videos, music, and online lessons. It's everything we did is about how to learn Tai Chi better, how to learn Tai Chi more enjoyably, more effectively. Then, of course, uh, I started workshops, uh, training instructors. I do different styles of Tai Chi. I practice them regularly, and I found, for me, different way, different perspective to see something. I think different style is like a different ways of looking at the elephant. Especially, I use my medical knowledge and the medical research knowledge to then analyze and making the Tai Chi more effective. We make pick up forms that is uh, much more health giving, much safer, less risk, and give you health benefit much quicker. Program I create, Tai Chi for Arthritis, being supported, adopted by Arthritis Foundation all over the world. The Centers of Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, and Arthritis USA has supported us because the program was found by the world's largest study for older adults to, to prevent falls. And also, it's also the world's largest study for people with arthritis and how much and how quick they can improve with Tai Chi for arthritis. Later on, I create other programs. They're all programs for health, but they're just sort of a little more focused on different things but they're all safe and effective. And um, if you're interested, come to our website. And here is a photo. The New Zealand government has paid pe people to learn Tai Chi to prevent falls. And they invite me, the um, ACC is the national government body, who invite me to teach instructors and master trainers. Also, I created Tai Chi for kids. So there is a program called Totally Wild. It is a program for kids nationally in Australia. So far in USA, we have done 22 annual workshops. That's it, annual workshop in Sydney. And this is a very first international Tai Chi for Health scientific conference in South Korea. And that was um, quite a lot of participants, and that was 2007. Since 2010, 14 years ago, we created uh, or we founded the Tai Chi for Health Institute. Uh, many of us feel that it's really important to have a non-profit institution to regulate and uh, ensure quality ethical standard. It is so good, we attract the best people, most passionate people about helping people with Tai Chi for Health and 
Um, I just found so much talent, so much enthusiasm with the institute, with the board. We have reached millions of people around the world and we all we want to do is use Tai Chi to help people to benefit, to bring better health and more harmony to the world. And this is the workshop in USA 2019, just before the pandemic, the Tai Chi for Health Institute's logo. That's the Sydney, beautiful views there. And I just jump out and this bird just fly free. It, it's like free us from being unwell. Two recent things. One, in Singapore, the government um, has organized in, in the Wellness Day, they have organized a group of people to come and learn Tai Chi from me. The CEO of People's Association, which is a Singapore national government body, the retiring CEO and the incoming CEO, and our chair of the institute, Professor Raymond Lau. Uh, well, I do know Chinese, but not as good as his. So we were together, and he translate, and 2,000 people behind us came to learn Tai Chi. And just imagine 2,000 people, 40 buses, and um, they got to get in within half an hour. So like a military operation. They were there within half an hour, uh, and then they can only stay for half an hour. It gets too hot in Singapore and can be high risk for older adults. Last year, September, the Harvard University in Boston has uh, first time organized, first time for the university, a conference called the Science of Tai Chi and Qigong by some famous people like Peter Wang, Professor Peter Wang and Gloria Yi. They both uh, top researchers around the world on Tai Chi and Qigong. And so just about so anyone who's well known in the research world, in the Tai Chi world, we're in that conference. I'm honored to present Worldwide Accreditation. My presentation, Wayne, really was, I met so many friends, so many people that we know each other by internet or, or by phones, by writing, and they were there. And so here's, um, here's Dr. Yang, Professor Song from South Korea, who's one of the high, highest respected Tai Chi researcher and master trainer and Tai Chi teacher as well. And uh, Peter Wang is um, it's one of the main organizers for this conference and well known for his research on Tai Chi. And that's me. And um, Professor Zhang is from Hong Kong. He's a professor, again, very well known for Tai Chi research. So I hope you enjoyed that whole story. Uh, 40, 25 years, and I got so much more to talk to you, but the most important things I want to let you know is that there's so many studies and so many people has found Tai Chi, it's an incredibly helpful creation that you can use it to improve health for personal development, for enjoyment, and you can just practice five minutes, 10 minutes, or like me, an hour or two every day, uh, or more. And um, Tai Chi is like this incredible tool that, that, that it can give you whatever you're looking for. Whatever you do, Tai Chi will help you to be stronger, physically and mentally, and allow you to think better and have more harmony within you. No matter what challenges you have, it will just help. And of course, it's very fair. It, it doesn't matter where, 
how talented you are, it's all about how much time and energy you put into it. And the more time you devote to learning Tai Chi, the more benefit you get out of it. Most importantly, it's just enjoyable doing Tai Chi. Thank you.